So, never say never. Say never say never whatever you do. Never say never, my friend. Oh, toi. If you believe that your dreams will come true, they'll come true in the end. Ah, 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 ah. Keep up your courage. Don't ever despair. Take heart and then come to town. Hope for the best. Work for the rest. And never say never again. Oh, but it's impossible. I'll never find my family. Ah, 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 ah. Never say never. And I'll say that going Hi, everybody. Welcome to my channel. This is where we study the 12 laws of mind that govern our lives and the one law that we've all ascended into that overrules them all. Now, don't get me wrong. They still happen, but they happen with love and grace. They don't happen with the caca anymore. So it's good to know these principles. Now, you know, I encourage y'all to, to throw in there, where, what have you been reading? What have you been thinking about all this? Because it's presented to us in so many ways. You know, it can hurt your head looking at all these different teachers and everything. It certainly, certainly was a plethora of them, okay? And you want to get to the source. I always do that. I've been doing that all my life. I'll read a book I really like, like uh, History of the World by H.G. Wells. And uh, then I went back and, and purchased uh, previous editions, including a first edition. And then read them and saw the differences in the perception and what had been learned and you know how he felt about some piltdown man was a good example he just was not buying that didn't look right some smell wrong <laughs> but he couldn't prove it and then after the man who claimed piltdown man was the missing link and had passed uh everyone came out and said yeah this is not this is, this is silly. This is a jackass job. A patron wanted me to clarify on the, the, the negative words. And you have to understand they're just words. Okay, they're words. There's no negative connotation to it unless you do that. Okay, the word no is not negative. The word no means I do not accept this. Okay? It's a feeling. Okay? In the mind of God, it's I did accept this. And this shall be no more. No more. It's that feeling. This ends now. You know, I don't care how it ends, but it ends now. <laughs> Your house catches on fire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's that song, you know, never say never, whatever you do. Because it, it elicits the opposite. Okay. I am never going to the Statue of Liberty. Well, to the, you know, infinite power within you, in your heart, that means I am blank going to the Statue of Liberty. Okay. Well, she's pretty confident about that. Let's make that happen. <laughs> and, you know, it's a self-assured confidence. You're convinced I'm never going to do that, okay? And you will do it if you see life objectively because you're falling under the karmic laws, okay? And you state it with confidence, you know, I'm never going to the Empire State Building. I'm never going to, the, this is Neville Goddard's ladder exercise. I'm not winning the lottery. I'm not winning the lottery. I'm not winning and what you're being is Peter the rock okay and you're a rock in this stream 
of consciousness, which is thought. All these thoughts, okay, are zooming past you in this stream. You don't want to get caught up in the rip current. <laughs> All right? You stay there and be a rock. Focused, 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 focus on this rock. Now everything starts working its way to you. All right, because you were a rock in this stream. And Emmett Fox um, states, you know, it's be scientific about it, you know, and sit back and think about God. So you're swimming in the stream, but you're swimming in the stream that's in the middle. Okay, and this is a constant in physics, uh, but it's a steady stream, and you stay in the middle. Okay, you're the rock now. I am wealthy, 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 I am wealthy. And you just saturate it, saturate your mind with it. I am wealthy, I am wealthy, I am wealthy, I am wealthy. And you are being this rock, okay? But it's the same thing as, I am not climbing that ladder, I'm not climbing that ladder, I'm not climbing that ladder, I'm not climbing. And the not is, there's no image for it. There's no image for never. There's no image for any of these things, okay? There's no image. So you have your, Noun and verb, okay, and adjectives are opinions, okay, <laughs> they're opinions, and everybody's got one, okay, because you're playing a person, all right, that's what you're playing, just like you're playing the tree, and you're playing the rock, and you're playing the house, and you're playing everybody. So you put yourself in the other guy's shoes in the stream of consciousness. You know, you can do that. And you sit down and be the rock. I am calm. I am peaceful. I'm serene. You're now in the stream. Okay, you're in the stillness. It's just zooming all by. Okay, you're in the eye of the storm. This is the stillness. So understand that those, that's where your temperature gets taken. So if you're saying that in a depressed manner, okay, you're, you're pressing it down. You don't want to do that. Okay, that's turning it inward and it's going to come outward and just don't do it. You know, it's depressing. And you want to be expressing, you know, and it's don't get caught up in the good or the bad that's judging. It's all right here. Okay. It's just thought. It's all it is. You know, it has no power unless you give it power. And that's by thinking of it, giving it your attention. And then it's about how you think about it. Okay. So you could say, you know, I am not going to go to that movie tonight. And somehow, somehow you'll go to that movie tonight. If you believe in the 12 karmic laws, if you, you know, have not risen above it, there'll be a way <laughs> found for you to go to that movie. You know, oh, well, I'm not going to that movie tonight. That's just how it is. Yeah, and ta -da. now this is where we get that irony from because it's you said it with confidence I am not going to that movie tonight I am going to that movie tonight and you said it with confidence okay so I hope this helps I hope the clips help emphasize what you um, see because, you know, I'm just trying to give you as much 
insight as I have and a movie, you know, a TV show, music. This is God talking to you straight from the heart. It's come straight from the heart, baby. He's talking to you. He's everywhere. He's everything. He's the only presence. And when you go into the stillness, into the silence, okay, and now you just, you're silent. Now you're a rock. You're one with consciousness, okay? You're the rock. Now what? You know? And this is the beauty of what Emmett Fox was saying, you know, get into the stream, think about God, read some spiritual teaching, read a little bit of, you know, some book that you've come to realize is telling the story, you know, whatever. And then you apply, just state what you want, you know, confidently. And that's staking your claim. You know, and then go back into the stream of thought, back thinking about God for a minute, you know, or two. And thank you, Father. You, you thank, you thank the Father, bringing that brings it together, you know, and then boom, there you go. So the word not, it depends on how you say it. It's not the words themselves. It's just a word. And then you have to understand what words have images associated with them. Okay? And negative words do not have any image to them. It's a feeling. It's a perception. Okay? I'm not going to walk the dog. Well, you'll walk the dog. I am going to walk the dog. You know, you'll walk the dog. It's, you're going to walk the dog either way. And then you'll get frustrated because you really meant you did not want to walk the dog. And you're quite confident you did not want to walk the dog. There's this conflict going on. Okay. No, you, you said, I am walking the dog confidently. You know, so there's this conflict. Okay. Judgment. That's a judgment. If there's conflict, there's a judgment. So you just forgive, forget, and walk away. All right? That's what you do. And it all works itself out. You know, and yes, there are certain things that you like that's part of your personality. Okay? And God will give you all those things. If you just go sit down and be, be with him, go be a rock with him. Imitate your father. Just sit and be. And let the stream of thought go past you. Then jump in. Think about him. What he is. What he does. And now. Claim it. You know. Thank you for your storehouse of riches. They're my storehouse of riches now. Thank you father. Thank you for your storehouse of riches. My supply is your supply. Thank you, Father. There's always a divine surplus. Whatever. And then get, thank you, Father. This binds it. Okay. And then back into that stream. God is wonder. I am wonderful. God is good. I am good. God is life. I am life. God is success. I am successful. You know? So I hope this helps. You know? Like I say, you know, it just is the way it is. And this is how language is. And how it's tied to your imagination. And this is how we all communicate and translate. I always mention to translations. So I hope this helps. Blessings to you. And thank you. Thank you for being here. And let me know what you think, man. It's great. I love all the different perceptions. They're just so beautiful. Well, I hope this helps. Blessings to you. And thank you. Thank you for being you. Never say
never. Whatever you do again. Never say never to me. See how easy. If you believe, you can come shining through. That's that's how it's gonna be. Perfect. <laughs> Now don't you go and give up, give out or give in. When the going's tough, just get tough and just tell yourself you're gonna win. Remember to look on the bright side till then, and never say never again. Stop.